Sometimes spreadsheets can get quite large and complicated. This spreadsheet is a simulation of gravity where there's a star, a planet, and another planet or moon, which with the current parameters input into the green cells, the uh, second planet or moon, if you want to call it that, is orbiting around the blue planet as the blue planet orbits the star. The point is not to go into this particular spreadsheet, but merely to show you an example of a large, complicated spreadsheet. It goes over to past Z to columns AA and AB, and vertically it goes down to over 500 rows of, of calculations. So quite large and unwieldy. So in a situation like this, let's say you wanted to compare the planet A data columns here with the planet B columns that are further to the right and off the edge. Well, you can do a lot of scrolling around, or a very handy feature is to hide some columns that you don't need to look at at that particular moment. So I'm going to select column F through column L and right click anywhere in those selected columns and choose hide. Now what has happened is that I have not deleted those columns. They're simply not being displayed on the screen. So we have the planet A calculations, the planet B calculations, and I can now compare them side by side as I scroll down through the rows of, of numbers. Now, uh, that can be very handy in large spreadsheets. The only tip-off you have that there are hidden columns is, well, the columns go A, B, C, D, E, and then M. So if you're observant, you'll notice that. Then also notice that the borderline between E and M is slightly thicker than the normal border between columns. So when you are ready and you want to see all those columns again, select E and M, right click, and choose unhide. And now you have the entire spreadsheet again visible. Very handy uh, technique when you're dealing with large, unwieldy spreadsheets.